Hello, it's Tim with Tadai Farm. We're doing another video here on the John Deere 6600 and this repair series here. Today we're going to be working on the yeah. unloading auger, particularly this gearbox. You can see that's got a lot of movement. And we need to see if it's in the gearbox or if it's in the fitting back air. So we're going to pull this off. The book says take these two bolts out. And then you should be able to get that and slide it out. If not, we'll take these four bolts out so we can get that out of there. So that's what we're going to work on here. So hang tight here. Now I do have one of these on the spare combine, the parts combine. Um, it feels to be in pretty good shape. So we're going to pull that one off too. <clears throat> Yeah, that's what I was afraid of. Well, we're going to have to get with John Deere. That is all wallered out in there. It is in bad shape, all thin here. It's been recapped once. So, there's a little bit of play in this little bit of play so we're gonna tear this apart see what it looks like in there see if we need parts we're gonna pull the other one off the other combine too so we'll be right back all right this is the one out of the combine we just took out a little bit ago in the video I've got this one I took out of the parts combine didn't do video of it same thing but I went ahead and broke it apart and found some bolts to go back in there and got this all back together. There's uh, sleeve bearings like this in there and a uh, seal. Well, on this one here, this side, which is the drive side, the seal is blown out and those bearings are seized up. But that's in pretty good shape. So we got it all put back together. There's a roller bearing there that's in good shape. So we're going to pull this one apart here. I did this one just to kind of see what was involved in it. So now I know what I got to do here. But uh, yeah, this is a little worn, the end of that shaft, compared to this one here. It's squared up pretty good. So that could be part of it. I, I'm sure that auger has a lot to do with this. Got the freezer trick again. And the seal. There you go. All right. Put a little of this in there. That's going to work good. Okay. I'm going to put some spray paint in there so that's painted. All right. We got this all painted up. It's ready to go. 
This is the one that came out of the parts combine. This is not chewed up near as bad as this is chewed up. So I put new seals in this one. That was the only thing wrong on this one. Got it cleaned out. Uh, so we're in good shape here. I'm just going to put it on the shelf. This is the one we're going to put in the combine. But we're going to finish this video up here. Thanks for watching um, on the uh, rebuild of these augers. Well, the, the gearbox for the auger. Uh, stay tuned for the next video. It's going to be working on the auger and getting it replaced. Um, and then we'll go from there. So anyway, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed.